All right, in this tutorial, all I'm going to show you is how to make a light material that will animate um, the light that is cast from a light. You'll see what I mean. So I've got a cloud texture here. There's not much to it. You can make yours however you want. That's just what I ended up with. Now, let's go to make new material. Name it whatever you want. Alright, and there's not really that much to it. You go and take your cloud material, plug that into emissive, and um, it's going to look really funny the way that we have it, so I'm going to go ahead and add a panner. And this will get it moving. And then I'll go ahead and add a coordinate as well. And this will allow us to, to tile it. Or in this case, um, actually stretched out. So I'm going to make a pretty big difference here. And that's moving pretty fast, so I'll, I'll make this. Alright, now under Mutually Exclusive Rights, you want to go down and check Use as Light Function. Alright. Now, I'm going to select my skylight in this case, but you could do any light. Under light, go to light component, and here's function. You remember we just selected our uh, material to be used as a function? So, select light function, and go and add your cloud, cloud material, and that's all it took. So, alright, this doesn't look fantastic, but this is just to kind of give you an idea. You can still go ahead and use all of your complex um, material shaders for your clouds as well to give them a dynamic and unique feel. So that's it to this tutorial then.